Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lexi and I thought I'd, shy, I'd finally share a Timu haul with you. I Yes, I discovered um, that awful website Timu. So I got a bunch of cute baby clothes and just a bunch of fun random stuff to share with you guys. So let's get into it because um, I have a few orders to share here and then um, some of them are gifts that I have already given away so I'll just have to show you pictures of it because I wasn't able to do this haul before um, but the baby is sleeping so I got a minute here right so the first thing I got for my office party is a little baby onesie it um, it should be zero to three months or yeah one to three months it was like two dollars um, so obviously the cheapest I found anywhere they had other office onesies they were like fifteen dollars for one on Amazon so two dollars was a great deal um, okay. I'll resist the urge to fold these back while I'm filming but I also got this one which is six months or three to six months uh, player three has entered the game I gave this actually to my husband for his birthday in August so this should fit Jack's probably next month because he's three months already I did get some balloons and now I couldn't find the package to show you guys Gosh. sorry everything just fell all right sorry about that I think I got everything cleaned up I just spilled my coffee everywhere so it was an emergency <laughs> Um, I was reaching for these stupid balloons, which are taped to everything and just made a huge mess. Um, hello, these are the balloons that I just ripped off my ceiling from downstairs. They're from my office party. I have not posted anything about that yet, but I'm still hoping to create some sort of video on it. Um, but yeah, I ended up ordering balloons off of Timu instead of like Amazon or anything else because it's way cheaper. Um, I think they were different sizes the brown ones are probably like five inch balloons and you got 30 pieces in here for 247 is what I paid for them and then 50 pieces of the gray balloons okay yeah these say five inch balloons and that was a dollar 88 for 50 balloons so I just wanted something cheap because um, I didn't want to spend a lot of money on this party so I got the brown and gray which is just a really hard color to find at Dollar Tree I got the black from Dollar Tree Okay, so that was basically everything for the office um, not showing you guys here because it's in the car but I got a little car seat gap filler it's okay it's like hard leather and it's it's in the car it was just a few dollars to like it was something to add the cart so I could use a coupon or something um, so yeah just a little car seat gap filler I have another onesie but it's in this bag here so I'll probably get that out later. I got, just so I don't forget anything, I'm just looking at my order here. I got these little disco balls, which are actually really fun. Um, these were for the office party as well. I had a little cafe disco sign. And these are um, rear view mirror hangers, which is funny if you watch the office because it's, um, yeah, they had a rear view mirror disco ball in the show. So I got a two piece for $2.48. And there is a Halloween pillow cover on here that I'm not showing, but um it's just got a little pumpkin on it. And that was just a few dollars as well. Okay, the thing that I also knocked down behind me is off-brand Legos. Okay. I guess they're pretty sturdy because only a few pieces fell off. I just knocked it over with um, everything. Anyways, so they're the like Lego flowers that you build, but they're not Lego brand, so they were like, I don't know, they were less than $20. I don't remember. I guess I could look. Okay, 18 I guess is what I paid for them. They were for my husband for his birthday, so he already put them together. So it's nice. You can kind of see um, and he said, you know, they worked well enough. Obviously, they might not go together as well as real Legos, but, um, 
Yeah, that's what they look like. And they held together pretty well, even though I just dropped them. That might be a little top heavy. <laughs> All right. Okay, I got these right on top here. So they are a present that I have not given yet. Um, thinking about saving them for Christmas because they're for my husband and his birthday just passed. Uh, they're little chess pieces. I've been wanting to get these for him forever because he's got a chess board with no pieces. So um, it was just like maybe half the price of Amazon to get them on here. And they look like really nice quality. I think the king is like a few inches tall. Maybe they were less than $5 for both wooden chess pieces. Lots, lots of presents in this haul. Let's see if I can show this to you guys next. Okay, this is a paint by number. Um, it comes with the paints and everything. I don't know why I feel like i got to show you all the paint stuff. I'm sure you would believe me. Um, I think it came with a little paintbrush too, just a tiny one. Anyways, this is the mat the pattern is a wolf with flowers so this one's not completed yet it's just the okay so this it's hard to tell which direction it goes so it's not painted so you probably can't see it but it's a pretty decent size like maybe like two by three feet um yeah so it's a little wolf let me try and get that folded back up Anyways, let's see if it will show me a picture. Not really close up. <laughs> okay. Well, it's a wolf with flowers, and they had a bunch of different patterns of um, paint by numbers on there, and it was less than $5 as well. Let's see here. I think that was everything from my first order. So that was my first order ever on. Timu and then let's see here I got one thing which I've already given away to my mother-in-law it was a baby onesie for Jackson let's see if I can get a picture up here okay so it says don't make me call my Gigi um because that's what we call her is Gigi and it was only like three dollars um so that was one thing Oh my god. I'm so unorganized and my coffee just fell again. So let's see here if I can find what's next. Sorry, there's so much stuff. Um so more pillow covers. So these ones I'll show you guys. I just don't have the other one in here. I think it's in the bedroom where Jax is sleeping. Um so this is a four pack. I've been I've had this in my Amazon cart. For a while and it's like $12 on there and it was $8 on Timu and I was going to order it last year and I didn't so anyways I didn't have Halloween um, pillow covers so that's what I do I just switch out my pillow covers every season usually every season or I just leave them playing if I get busy but so this is Black Flame Hocus Pocus which this might be my favorite just because I was going to order just a single one. I didn't think they had a four pack and then I ordered this one and then realized they had a four pack so I switched it out. Um, this one's also really nice. The Brewing Company, Sanderson Sisters and then Salem Broom Company. So just a four pack of simple black and white ones and I also got that pumpkin one with the orange pumpkin. Amazingly, I dropped my coffee twice and it hardly spilled a drop so it there's not that much left though. So. Um, see if I can find those. I cannot. Okay. I got some refrigerator refrigerator liner mats, some luminous butterfly steaks. I gave those away already. There's just a couple dollars. 
Okay. Well, this I can show you. Um, it's kind of hard to see in here, so I guess I'll take it out. Um, even though it's a gift, so I kind of want to just keep them nice. And I'll save them again for Christmas. We have all the birthdays between July and November in my family. And then it's Christmas in December. So trying to get ahead on gifts. Okay. Why? These are like attached to the cardboard. I literally cannot get these off. How? I don't know. It's attached to the cardboard. They're little um, chicken garden stakes. So you put them in the ground and it's just a little chicken silhouette. So you got uh, four or five in here. I think there's four. Yeah, I don't know. I don't have it up on here. Wait, okay. Yeah, it says five pieces and this was three fifty. So again, way cheaper than on Amazon. So I don't know if it's the same quality. But a lot of this is like stuff that I was going to get on Amazon, like I had on a gifting list, and then I found it cheaper on Timu. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd try it out. Most of the stuff I've gotten so far seems fine. The balloons, I didn't say, but they were kind of chemically tasting when you blew them up, so kind of gross, but they were like two dollars instead of seven or ten so good enough for me <laughs> all right I'm just gonna start showing you stuff and then if I can't find the price on here it's fine <laughs> um this is a little outfit I have not given away yet but I was thinking of giving it to Erin for Christmas as well um it's got a little hat with it. That's his little man, as well as the matching pants. Um, and this is six to nine months, which is why I'm going to wait till Christmas because it will fit him around that time. So I think it'll be a good Christmas gift. And then I'm going to give it to Aaron because it's got a little daddy and me shirt. It'll be cute. Um, that was six dollars. So again, something. You can find it on Amazon for like 20 or you can pay like $6 on Timu for it. And it's really good quality, really nice material. I haven't washed it yet. Um, this is a shirt, again, for my sister. So another gift. Her birthday is in October. It's folded really nicely, so I don't want to unfold it all the way. But it says, um, Rocking the Dog Mom and Aunt Life. So I thought that was absolutely perfect and it was actually $7, which kind of normal price for a t-shirt. But if you're getting a novelty shirt, like ordering on Amazon or something, you know, it'll be like $25 or $30. So $7 ain't bad, right? Let's see here. Oh, this was in this order. It is a play mat that you fill with water. So it's a tummy time mat for Jax. I thought it would be really fun. He's doing a bit more tummy time he can lift his head up but doesn't like it all the time so we'll see if he likes this he might hate it but it was five dollars instead of the one I had in my Amazon cart which was at least 10 or 15 if it wasn't on sale so like a third of the price of Amazon I'm gonna try and drink my coffee before I spill all of it Alright, let's see here, what else is in this order? I got this, they had these little spoons with sayings on it, it's like a long spoon for stirring stuff. Um, this one says my peanut butter spoon, it, it's for my mom, so I'm probably spoiling all the gifts in this video if they watch my videos, but you run a team move haul. Uh, this, they were cheap, it was $1.50. I also got one for Aaron that I got in a bag in front of me here. Okay, let's go through the um, clothes in front of me. I just got a little stack of baby clothes. They are adorable and by far the best thing I've gotten off of TV so far is the baby clothes. Um, again, it's just so much cheaper than Amazon and 
they're so soft so this little sweatshirt it says little dude and it came with the sweatpants so they're not like fuzzy on the inside but they're not not soft you know so it's like a thin sweatshirt material and it's so cute and again instead of paying like 17 on Amazon I got this for like seven dollars and then I couldn't I don't know why I thought this was so cute I don't even like Lion King that much but it says I'm working on my roar um, I got it in six, in nine months so I'll be wearing it like six to nine months probably so again around Christmas time um, but yeah he just didn't need any more little clothes and it's a very very soft material I love it it's so soft the print I don't know I haven't washed it yet so I don't know how it will stay on in the wash but it was three dollars so adorable and so soft okay and then this one was basically five dollars it was like 487 it's a little romper I got it in 9 to 12 months and it's got a little dinosaur and the asymmetrical lines and there's just only three buttons. Is that right? Okay. Usually they have a ton of buttons down here but it's only three. So, but it should still stay on just fine. So it's a really adorable little romper. Again, really soft and it was $4. Okay, I had, this was the largest order I've had so. Where'd it go? Okay. Here it is. This is really cool. I have some of these. Well, I have one of these kind of things. It's metal, like laser cut metal wall decor. So it is metal. It's really nice. It's not like cheap plastic. And this was, I believe, $7. Yeah, six fifty. dollars um, But it's hexagons. So I might just give it to my sister. Um, or if we have a party for her, I can use it as decor because she likes hexagons. So do a hexagon theme. Um, so some of the stuff I got for that, but I'm not sure if we're doing it. So I'll just give it to her then. So that was six dollars. Well, this was the onesie I was looking for earlier. It's still in the bag. remember how much this was I'm sure it was just a few dollars again much cheaper than the $15 one I was literally had in my cart on Amazon I'm like oh I have to get this for Erin but um it says pack my diapers and going fishing with daddy and it's another present for him which is why I have it um packed away and not washed already so it's not as soft as the other one but it's still really nice material And I haven't washed it yet, so I don't know how this will wear, but uh, it feels like it's on there pretty well. So there's that. It's like lots, lots of gifts. I don't think Aaron watches my videos, so at least he won't know what he's getting for Christmas. <laughs> okay, I've got um, a couple kitchen things here, kind of. Um, this is a little six pack tiny little plastic things they were like a dollar dollar 29 it was a six pack so you get two of each color and what it is is you put it on a can to cover the lid which I thought was really nice because obviously I drop my drinks and knock them over all the time and I have knocked over a can already with this on it and it barely spilled any like soda on the carpet so I think they work okay and it's just little pieces of plastic that you put on a can literally and then you just twist it around when you want to drink so that was a dollar I thought it was funny but I'm like that's actually kind of useful for me because I knock cans over all the time um, then we didn't have any of these egg ring things so I really just got it for the circle but it came with five different shapes so there's the circle the star the flower the heart and the little Mickey Mouse shape or bear or whatever. Um, it was three dollars for five pieces and 
Now we can make different shaped eggs so we can make like breakfast sandwiches and stuff with the circle. Yeah, maybe uh, when Jax is a bit older, maybe he'll like shaped eggs. I don't know. Let's see here. There, there's more in this order. So I've got a little Aldi bag here. I thought it would be easier to share with you guys. Um, I couldn't. I don't know where I put the refrigerator mats. Oh, they are in here. Okay. I didn't realize I put them in the bag. So it's just this little pack. I got the clear refrigerator mats. I don't really think they work that well. I just put one in the fridge downstairs. Um, they're flexible so they're not like hard so I can't put them on the wire shelves and I put them on like the clear plastic shelf and it just kind of slid around it's not like sticky on the bottom so this might be a dud um but it's supposed to be like a shelf liner so I could put them in my cupboards to make it easier to wipe it out um it was just like four dollars and you get four pieces so it's like a dollar per mat um and so these size it doesn't cover the whole shelf in the fridge but if I put like two next to each other maybe it would cover a shelf but yeah like I said it might not work out in the fridge but I did clean out my fridge recently so I was thinking you know it'd be nice to have something uh lining it to make it easier to clean out next time okay this I thought was so cute and it was just a couple of dollars. I think it's literally, yeah, a dollar fifty. Um, it's this little tiny wooden sign. This is little man cave, no girls allowed except mommy. Um, yeah, it's actually very thin, like very, very lightweight and small. But I mean, it's cute. We can hang it up in Jax's room probably when he's a little older. But it was a dollar fifty, and I loved it. So it was so cute. Um, yeah, just very cheap thin wood but I guess it doesn't really matter all this stuff in this bag oh found another piece of Lego stuff oops wait I got this it's been again in my Amazon cart for a while it was just a bit cheaper on Timu I mean it was two dollars instead I think the one on Amazon is like ranges between five and seven dollars maybe um and it's just one of these little sticky balls that you put in the bottom of your purse to collect dust and crumbs so i had it i just grabbed it out of my purse and i guess it works because it's got some stuff stuck to it and i'm guessing you can take it out to clean it but i'm not really sure how and i don't want to break it <laughs> um you might just have to clean it inside this but I mean it's two dollars so it might be just something that you replace every once in a while I've never had one of these but again I got crumbs on the bottom of my purse so it's something that'll be nice to have I just dropped it we'll get that later probably okay oh, there's a piece of Lego down there anyways we're not done yet <laughs> Uh, again, um, hexagons for my sister. These are a pack of four of earrings I got for two fifty for her, and I'm not sure if I'm keeping them or not. They were bigger than I expected. Um, I got danglies for her so she can switch out the hardware because she's got sensitive ears. Anyways, long story short, they are bigger than I thought. They're almost like two inches, um long so yeah they're not as dainty as I expected I don't know if she'll like them but they seem like fine material there it's like a hammered metal and there's four different colors you get gold silver like a gunmetal gray and rose gold so they're really pretty I mean I could wear a couple of them I don't know if she would like this because she usually wears dainty earrings I feel like and they're big but they're kind of pretty still so we'll see it was two dollars I don't know if I'll return them um, you can also get like just a one pack for like a dollar but I just got the four pack so yeah there's that there's like the one thing I was thinking about 
returning. Um, but of all this stuff, that's not really a lot. Just a $2 set of earrings. Um, and I guess the fridge liners aren't that great. But like I said, maybe I'll use them in the cupboard or something. Was that everything? No. Nope. And there will be more. Um, well, there are more orders already. So there should be more hauls in the future if you enjoy this. Make sure to like this video and, you know, subscribe for more. Um, I've already got an order that hasn't arrived yet of Renaissance Festival stuff. So, yeah, keep an eye out for that. But in this order, I got a dishwasher um, magnet that says dirty and clean. They had a few different styles of this. I got the, like, gray and white one. Um... It was just under four dollars. It was like three sixty eight. Yeah, I had a little like his hers magnet that I got from Dollar Tree, the like, reversible magnet, um, which is cute. But we don't. It doesn't work for our household. <laughs> we, instead of taking turns, we just. I'm always asking, is the dishwasher clean or dirty? So I just got a different kind of magnet that works way better for us already. Okay think for this order that was everything. I talked about the butterflies that glue in the dark for the garden that I already gave away so I don't have to show you. Um, and then one more thing it was just delivered separately. So a uh, baby fresh food feeder. So um, they have ones like this from Dollar Tree but they're like mesh. This I believe is silicone. So it's got the little teether and then the little thing. So we'll make sure to like boil this before giving it to them. But yeah, they're just silicone little like mesh, if you will, things for him to suck on and you put fruit in there. So when he starts teething, which is really only a couple months away, these will be really nice and you can just put fruit in them for for him to snack on it's like small medium large little nipple things I guess I don't know what to call them and this if I didn't say I think it was only a few dollars like I might have gotten it on sale so yeah it was literally a dollar ninety nine so not much more than the dollar store ones that are just mesh which I don't know if they're better or not but you can boil the silicone ones I guess yeah. I guess that's better. This was a caramel ribbon crunch frappuccino, by the way. But it melted and I added cold brew to it, so. Going on day three with that. Alright, let me pull up the next order real quick. Okay this before I forget because I don't have it to show you um, was also part of this order I ended up having a $10 off coupon so I just added it even though it was $13 <laughs> um, oh my gosh I can't get the picture pulled up for you guys please okay there it is Okay, it's sold out, so it's not letting me see it again, just like the wolf thing. What it is is a cup, so I'll show you a similar thing. It's just a little stainless steel tumbler like that, but it's pink and it says best GG ever. So same style as this, but pink, and again, it was $13. Um, I wanted to get it on, like, sale because it was $8 when I added it, but I had a $10 off coupon so it was basically only three dollars right oh my gosh this website sorry I can't get to my orders okay here we go this is the last thing that was delivered I have stuff that hasn't come yet so everything in this bag puts one thing on the floor And then I gotta go put everything back <laughs> where it was. A lot of it was just in my closet to give away for Christmas, but oh boy. 
that sound was the Legos falling again because apparently this was holding them up. Um, this is going to be tough to show you in the packaging, which I don't really want to take it out. Oh, there's coffee on it. Good thing there was plastic around this because otherwise it would have gotten on the mat. Um, it is a kitchen floor mat, so it's padded. Sorry, the coffee. I don't want it to get on anything. Um, it was... Okay, originally like five or six dollars. I got this for a dollar fifty because they have these random, like crazy seventy percent off things. So this was a dollar fifty for a kitchen mat. So I can't complain that it's kind of uh, not the material I was expecting. Well, I haven't actually felt it. Like it's it's soft. It's actually really soft and squishy. So I mean. I think it gets great for a kitchen mat. It's just like, I don't know. I don't know what material I was expecting. It's soft and it's got a chicken on it and a sunflower and eggs. And it was less than $2 for a kitchen mat. So I actually got this for my mother-in-law. Um, this is 19.6 by 31.4 inches if you're curious. They had a few different sizes. Um, this is just like a standard size, I think, for a kitchen mat. Okay. Almost done, and then I got a mess to clean up behind me. Alright, more hexagon stuff. Um, this is something, again, it was cheap, so it's like whatever, but it's not what I was expecting. They are car cup holder coasters, and it was $2, which I think is overpriced for what I got, but, um... So what I was expecting was I have car cup holder coasters. They're from Amazon and they're like the ceramic thick ones. That's all I've ever seen for car coasters. These, I mean, they're fine. They're just like, not leather, but they're like a bendable fabric material and it's a little lining on the bottom. So they're fine. They're just not what I expected. It was $2 for um, two. And anyways, they're hexagons. So this is way premature but I figured when uh, my sister starts driving she doesn't have her license yet um, I'm gonna give her a little car gift and I thought the hexagons are perfect and it was two dollars so I I ordered it okay I got another one of these spoons for Aaron it says I seriously love you like cereal it's a, it's a cereal spoon but it's not really that great for a cereal spoon I think it's for like stirring coffee, basically. Um, but the other one was for peanut butter, so I don't know. I don't know, maybe you can use it for cereal. It's just a long, skinny spoon. Again, these are like a dollar fifty, dollar twenty-nine. So just got another thing for him. So two more things. Um, I think I saved the best for last, but I got a hexagon plate again for my sister's you know birthday party if we have one we're gonna do hexagon themed so and i thought the black and gold was really chic because she's i mean she, she's almost 16 okay <laughs> so um we don't need like a little kid birthday party the black and gold is really chic and just kind of like a grown-up birthday party you know i thought that'd be pretty because otherwise like people do like hexagon and bee parties and it's for like baby showers usually so this is more like grown up and not like a baby shower it's like a birthday party anyways so that's the hexagon plates how many were in there so I didn't even tell you it was four dollars um but much cheaper than anything on Amazon they're 10 inches and you get eight pieces in here so probably half the price of anything you would find on Amazon like that and I think bigger and better quality than Dollar Tree a little bit. Okay. Best for last. Maybe. I don't know. It's more baby clothes. So I think those are the best. Um, it came with this little hat. The pants. With pumpkin knees. Printed on. And not the like, softest material. Like that blue onesie. But it's pretty decent fabric. Um, I got it in three to six months. Because October is next month and he'll be four months so I guess three to six months is what he'll be in <laughs> um this is the onesie so you 
this is my first Halloween um it's pretty cute it's not like the cutest first Halloween outfit I've seen but it was seven dollars compared to like the 20 something dollar ones on Amazon so I say good enough for something that he'll probably wear once um for a picture and then pee on anyways so my first Halloween pumpkin knees and the hat so if you need baby clothes I do recommend checking out Timu for a bunch of cute and cheap stuff um stay tuned for if, especially if you like right re renaissance themed stuff I've got more gifts for people I've got just fun random stuff and it's probably not the last order that I will place on this website so um yeah I think that is everything and if I forgot anything I'll show you guys in the next haul uh, it's Labor Day weekend when I'm filming this, so I hope you're all having a great weekend. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Bye!